Hi, and welcome to another episode of Mr. Puzzle. Today with another puzzle called Expert 9, I think. It's made by Daiko Games in Romania, and it's a disentanglement puzzle. Means the task is to free this red ring here from the rope. I know that a lot of you guys consider these rope puzzles as very difficult. Actually, I like them a lot, and um, I'm really looking forward trying this one because this is a level five, so the highest difficulty level of Daiko Games. And I'm really interested to see if this is really as difficult as is stated here, or it's if it's easier. Overall, I can recommend these Daiko Games puzzles because they have a very good price to value rating. I think this one is only 15 euro. I think absolutely reasonable for what you get. You will see it later. And in addition to this puzzle, I would like to show you another fidget toy, same as in the previous episodes. And these are the Nano Magnetic Spheres, also called Gyro. This comes in this little stand here that you can place it on your desk. And these are two magnetic spheres. Let me get the box over here. There is an explosion view on the box and it explains the single part. So there are two um, outer spheres that are transparent and then there are some rare earth magnets inside floating on these um, parts that can self-adjust based on the magnetic field of the other orb. And this is a pretty cool fidget toy. It's just something to fidgeting around and play with it. And you can, whoa, <laughs> so this is really, really cool. And during phone calls, this is a, or phone conference calls, <laughs> this is a pretty cool fidget toy, I can tell you, to get the time over. <laughs> and I just want to show you also here how sensitive the mag these magnets are by using a very strong magnet like this one. And from what distance these things react on the magnetic force of this magnet. So if I turn it around, it's also turning around and this is pretty fascinating. You see this? Very fascinating, but watch out that they do not connect too hard, that they are damaged. However, these are called nanodots, gyro orbs. And I put your link in the video description where you can get this one just in case you are interested to buy them. Now let's continue here with today's puzzle, the Expert 9 by Daiko. So, let's just get it out of the box. Unboxing in one second. So, here we go. This is the complete puzzle. It also comes with this nice flyer showing you the complete collection of Daiko. And I reviewed another one earlier. I think this was this one here. I put your link up here that you can just check this one out. And let's just have a look. So, there is a rope over here holding the ring and then there's another one holding the ring over here so I would expect you need to con disconnect them step by step and oh yeah and this one is not glued this one can be actually moved here it's gonna be very interesting I see and after this water break you will see my first attempt trying to solve this puzzle let's just put it like this and now let's start with the puzzle as I mentioned this ring seems to be connected by this loop over here and also by the rope over here. And first thing I'm gonna do now, or I'm gonna try to do now, is to remove this side here or this rope from this part of the puzzle. So let's just check this out. Mm, no, this was not a good move. Oh, okay, this is this is upside down probably. So I might need to put it here from the top. Let's see if this could work. No, this is also not good, I think. Let me start again from the beginning. No success until now. Let me just think how I could disentangle the thing. I need to move first through this one. This is definitely needed. And then... If they are sorted in the right order, like one ring, another ring, another ring, um, I can solve this thing in, in seconds. But if they are arranged like this, this is very confusing for me and I still don't know which one is the first ring, the second ring and the third ring. Interesting. Nope. 
go nowhere until now. The structure is confusing. I still don't understand which comes first and which comes last. Pretty interesting so far. Okay, let's see if I go like this. Can't be right. I need to get it out of this ring here, and the only way is to get it around this ring, which I cannot do right now because I'm in the inside. These two sticks, they are really struggling me. Cannot imagine that there is another move than this one in the beginning. This looks so right. If you've seen the video of the previous puzzle, this looks very much similar. It's actually not. It's actually completely different because they are, as mentioned before, one by one by one. Probably the same mythology, but completely different, or much more confusing. One hour, I think, or I don't know how long I already tried, but this is really seriously difficult. Okay, let's try to imagine or to simplify the thing somehow. What if, if this one would not be here? If this would not exist, I would go up here. I would go up here. I would go higher into this position. And if this would not be here now, I could move this rope around here and take it off. Yes. So this one is the seems to be the key part that's blocking me from taking it off. But how to get around this this piece? I Oh, I think I think I got an idea. I did. I tried this before, but I think it was not possible. Because if I would be able to take this rope and put it uh, above or here on the top, I could move this around, the rope around here, and take it off this ring. But it's too short, it seems. Let, let's see. If I take it, take the maximum length. <gasps> oh, it seems to be possible. Now, over here. Yes, 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 I think I got it. No. I did not. Yes, I think I, it's it's solved. Can you see it already? No, it's not. No, <laughs> no. But I think I'm close. I think I'm close. Get it up off the top. Get it around here. So what do I need to do now to get it off? I'm done with the first part. Oh, finally! Oh, you see my hand. <laughs> and now it's time to remove the rest of the rope. I hope this will be a little bit easier. This one here is actually a pretty interesting design, and I know how to solve it. I'm a little bit lucky here because this can be also very tricky. And the trick is to pass um, this knot here with the ring. Just need to be go back, go through here through the first part, then pull the knot to the other side. So I pull it through here, push it or whatever to the other side. Take the ring, and pass the knot with the ring through here, 
Like so. Get the knot back to the other side. And knot is passed. As I mentioned, this is actually a very, very tricky thing if you are not familiar with this type of knot or puzzle. And now only the last piece coming close. Ah, okay, go back again. <laughs> oh man, this, this puzzle is driving me crazy here. This is insane. And... Huh? What's going on? I'm completely confused. Maybe like this. Actually, it's interesting how tight these tolerances here are of these rope parts or of the length of the rope it's exactly fine-tuned that it's possible but it's that it's very difficult to find a solution ah okay let me try the following let me go back through this loop over here and now let's go over the loop because then I should be able to take it apart over here okay um, I think this is only a thing of positioning the parts in the right place to so get it over here here we go here we go and oh hallelujah <laughs> i'm done i'm done guys can you believe it i have no idea how long this took me but it's definitely a serious difficult puzzle mainly because of this part here this took me a tremendous amount of time and thinking to fix this one i tell you this puzzle is incredibly difficult um i would rate it with a four out of a maximum of five on my personal difficulty rating scale and definitely if you look for a puzzle or a not a beginner puzzle but to get into puzzling this is the puzzle for you to get it's absolutely worth the money and you have a lot of fun as you saw just keep trying and at one point you will make it so let me just get it back together so let me just quickly as quick as possible let me get this thing back together maybe with some time lapse let's see we'll get this thing over here and get it over here above the ball This one I showed you before, I go through the loop. I pull the knot to the other side. I take my ring and slide it through the knob. Through again. Like so. Here we go. Then I get it in again and now it's getting difficult i think it was through here and through here and through here get it around and now there was this very very difficult move very difficult to find because you need to stretch the rope get it down here Get it here. All the way in. Okay. I think I only need to move one time over the top and not two times. And here we go, back in the initial condition. Oh, I won't touch any puzzles today anymore. This one was really, really difficult for me. I hope you enjoyed this puzzle and I hope, and as I mentioned, I won't touch any puzzles anymore today. I just take my two nano gyro balls, play a little bit, and that's it for today. I hope you liked this episode. If yes, just Leave a like, comment below what you think about this puzzle. Was it interesting? Would you also like to try a puzzle like this one? Or would you prefer to try another one? Let me know which one. 
Do you like this fidget toy here as much as I do? If yes, let me know. Links in the video description. And until next time, keep on puzzling.